shit, did this rip? Hey, girl, hey. I have made about 8 million promises that I would make to 50 Seconds of Shade for RuPaul's Drag Race Season 8, and I haven't sort of delivered on that yet, much like Thorgy hasn't delivered on that big mouth that she's got going on. Anyways, I don't do makeup because that would be terrible and hilarious all at the same time. I'm trying to like stay as perfectly still as possible because this dress is starting to rip. I just wanted to show Derek Barry that it's really not that hard to sew a dress based on the Tin Man. I decided to sort of do a little bit of a play on like Claire Underwood because the Tin Man is a heartless bitch, which kind of plays into the two episodes I'm gonna talk about today. I wanna to talk about the outfits in the Wizard of Oz episode because it's basically like Project Runway. Oh my god, it's so exciting. Let's talk about Chi Chi's Dorothy. Chi Chi could have gone a lot farther with this Dorothy. I mean, this is basically like, you know, junior skating pageant. And the kid's not really good, so the mom doesn't really want to spend a whole lot of money on the costume, so she kind of like glues something to the kid, like right before she goes on stage. Y'all know it's true. Bob kind of did the same thing as Chi Chi, where it's basically like really like cheap Russian hooker ice skating costume. Look up Irina Slutskaya and tell me that that woman wouldn't have worn this thing. Thorgy, I don't like know what the judges were going on about. The cutest thing about Thorgy's look was like the glasses and the wig. Everything else looked like American apparel, which is Alaska Willem and that other bitch's thing. I don't remember who the other bitch was. I can't breathe. Robbie Turner, God bless <laughs> his soul. I thought it was cuter than the judges thought it was. But at the same time, it was basically just a bunch of fabric wrapped around him, but like a lot of fabric wrapped around him. Whereas Derek had like the anemic version of that and just wrapped a single piece around him. Again, Derek, steal your fantasy girl. Kimchi, I think, did like an okay job. It was okay, but she had clearly stolen those stockings from Layla. And I just, the, once I saw that, I could not see anything else. And last but not least was Naomi, who looked fucking fabulous. And if any of those bitches thought they had a shot at that challenge after they looked at Naomi's look, they were smoking crack. So yeah. And actually, since I'm dressed like Claire Underwood, let's just jump into the second episode, shall we? Drag politics is my everything, and I love that Bob the Drag Queen keeps playing white women that I love, like Carol Channing and Hillary Clinton. Funny, they both have the same haircut. Kind of. So, I loved Bob and Derek's commercial. I am so happy that they were declared the winners. But the real story was like, Thorgy <laughs> having like an epic meltdown and <laughs> just like, her Thorgy got everywhere. Like that Thorgy got messy. My favorite part of the episode though was watching Chi Chi <laughs> lose it. I just fell over. I am officially the Kim Chi of my own vlog. Chi Chi killed that lip sync. It was an honor to watch. I'ma take this thing off before I lose circulation to the lower half of my body. Like, comment, subscribe. Tell me how poorly this dress is put together, but at least it's a dress, bitch. Bye!